Ladies, gentlemen, you doing good? I hope you do. I hope you do. This is 19th of August, which means tomorrow will be 20th of August. For the US, there is a very special day every year called 4th of July. Here, we have a very interesting, very, very special day. Once a year, <coughs> sorry, once a year, we have it in August, 20th of August. We are celebrating that we are more than a thousand years old. And it will be commemorated by fireworks. Absolutely amazing, very, very, very expensive groundbreaking fireworks. So basically, when you head to Budapest, you know that is basically sliced in half by the river Danube. You go to anywhere really near the river and you can be, I believe you can be on, on the bridges. We have lots of bridges to choose from. I remember I was last time with my family, I was near Margit or Margaret Island the Margaret Bridge we were standing on and we were watching the fireworks and they are really great accompanied by music and all sort of stuff so that will be tomorrow actually it was <clears throat> quiet 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 a big debate that you know in today's world in this climate they should do it or not you know because lots of people are gathering here you don't have to wear uh, mask at all. People are not really social distancing at all, at least. Well, I didn't see that anywhere in the shop, queuing up anywhere. No, they don't do that. Also, I haven't seen anywhere places where you can sanitize your hands. Or maybe they have it, I don't know, I haven't seen it either. So that's why there was quite a big debate if they should do this or no. At some point they decided not to do it and then it's back on again. And I think if you're anywhere nearby, you should go get to the river, you know, and watch the firework because it will be much bigger, much better than ever before. <clears throat> so I decided on this occasion I will tell you three things I suggest you if you're in Budapest you should visit. First of all, you should head up, 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 up the hill to the castle, to the Buddha castle. You don't need to read any descriptions. You just go up there, you look down at the city, you can see the whole capital of Hungary, and you just walk the street and you can feel the history there. You can see the buildings, you just walk up there, everything is free and this is a great place to be. And after that, the second place, obviously I already mentioned, the Margaret Island, when I had my first kiss, if I remember well. I think I do, that was my place, the first place where I had a kiss and it was absolutely hmm, Ah, very, very interesting, you know, <laughs> the first kiss. Obviously, that is very important for other things as well. Our national poet wrote all, <clears throat> most of his important works there as well, called Janos Arany. He loved Margaret Island and called it, well, Island of the Rabbits. And the third one I like to mention suggest you to go to and that is called the hero square this is a very it is basically a square obviously as in the name and has a, a round shape of um <clears throat> of like a sort of like a stage where they put the statues the lifestyle statues of all the people who led this country, all the kings, all the important people. And, and that is a very situated place. And you really feel something that is amazing as art is amazing. And obviously the history, you can see all the kings of Hungary. So these three places, 
and all the places are great to walk around you can spend there if you want you can spend there five minutes if you want you can spend there a whole day enjoy